What's up guys? So I know I haven't done a vlog in a really long time, maybe a couple weeks or something, but um, I did get a chance to post one of my movie projects if you had uh, the opportunity to see it. Thanks for watching it and giving me uh, compliments and critiques and such. Um, I also put a couple videos uh, from the Orgy concert, so the concert report should be up, I believe, this week. I don't really remember. Um, in a couple videos I mentioned I was going to go see Asiatics, so don't expect to see a live report for that because I didn't go. Um, an unfortunate event happened after the orgy concert and I was unable to go, so um, I am kind of negative $45 from that. Uh, the tickets weren't that much, it was 15 bucks, but uh, I put $30 worth of gas in my car and I had a car accident and no more car. Uh, it wasn't a bad one, nobody got hurt. Uh, at least not physically, just emotionally, I guess. Uh, a little bit mentally, so that's why um, my postings have been a bit scattered a bit, but I think I'm back to getting that creative energy back, and now I'm trying to fit in watching movies and anime and dramas and stuff again, and hopefully doing more fanfiction. But uh, that doesn't really concern you that much, except for when I actually review the stuff. Um, I wasn't really planning on doing a actual maintenance vlog or anything because I don't really have much to say. I was just going to answer a question, but might as well, whatever. Um, let's see. First of all, I read that Anne Cafe is coming back. If you had an opportunity to see how I felt about that before, saying pretty much I said I didn't mind if they didn't come back because I, I like the way it is now and that's not offense to Ang Cafe the band and I did have a poster of Ang Cafe but that poster's in my room and I'm in the dorm so I don't have any Ang Cafe posters in my dorm sorry but I really like LC5 like way more than Ang Cafe and I've liked Ang Cafe for a few years and I really like Can X Canon 2 um, I guess Takia was doing guitar work for Pico. I really don't like Pico that much. Um, and Taruki was doing, I think, support guitar work with Chisato or something. I'm not sure, but every now and then I see his pictures with, on blog sites. So I guess Kefekos are happy about the revival. Some people thought it was an April Fool's joke because it was posted yesterday, but it's not. So, I just hope, I mean, I guess as a in cafe listener, that their material is way better than what they left us with. Otherwise, go back to your, your side projects, whatever you're know, working on. Um, recently, Seven Cents is disbanding. I'm really sad about that, but some people are not surprised because they're really familiar with uh, Juka's patterns of leaving bands because of stuff but I'm just sad and then I kind of thought about it and I'm like what if if they disband Arena picks up Ivy since Remy is on hiatus and most likely leaning towards disbandment and I really don't want them to disband because they're not that bad and Blacklist hasn't really released anything like live disc or an album or mini or single or anything except videos on their YouTube channel well, maybe they'll just you know come back together and make like a whole new band that's not Dio just something else I, I don't know just that thought but I'm really sad because they were actually really improving and I should have a review on Silent Assassin their last their latest single soon um, let's see, uh, I recently saw that Daichi Mura is releasing a new single on May 2nd, so I'll get to listen to that, I'm really excited. Um, lastly, I don't want to really talk about this too much because I already had to, like, talk about race issues already, and I had this giant, not really giant, but this 
pointless debate going on on my one of my uh, posts about Jenny Hung and the whole racist situation and Jeremy Lin, blah blah blah. And I even mentioned in one of my my videos that I would not talk about race anymore. But I mean, this came up. Um, I hope you guys got a chance to read uh, my Hunger Games review. It probably isn't the most exciting because I'm not. I've never read the series whatsoever. And on the other hand, I didn't even want to see the movie in the first place. My mom dragged me there, and I ended up liking it, so I'm not regretting the the uh, experience. But um, I read a couple articles and stuff through friends that people were complaining about three of the characters, three of the black characters, and these are so-called fans, and one article I was wondering if maybe these fans are illiterate, because in the book, uh, Rue is described as having brown skin, or dark skin, or whatever. And in the movie she is, and apparently a lot of people are surprised and weren't sad when something happened. And sorry if I ruined the movie for you. Um, it's just sad that things like this are still happening. I know I said that before, but I mean it's still sad. But honestly, I really don't want to like talk about it too much. People just need to get over it, and they need to accept it. And I'm really happy that the other cast members are s supporting them. Uh, two out of three of the people didn't really respond to it. Even the person who played Rue didn't really directly say anything to these people that had negative comments about her being in the movie. And I really, really, really commend the casting director for not regretting her choices. Way to go! Uh, so, all I have to say, I guess, is to keep checking the blog, thank you for the support, uh, there's a ton of material coming up, like, I'm, I'm really, like, ahead of myself now, and I'm feeling good, and I'm really happy that I'm back on my game, and I'll probably have some more live footage re-uploaded on the new channel spontaneously if I don't really feel like, you know, doing a, another video blog. Um, I'm gonna answer a question, so that's gonna be the next video if you guys are interested. Um, speaking of questions, if you have questions for me, whether it's opinion stuff, like my readers, viewers question, you can send that to my email. Or if you have questions about myself, my Miko 101 stuff, you can um, send in my email. All the information is below in the description box, my email, and the blog link, so please check that out, don't forget to leave comments, and you can always, you know, request things for me to review. Um, everyone have a lovely week, it's nice and sunny, and, you know, spring. Peace, guys.